Hi, this is Slosh. Space Peanut. Buzz. Welcome back to Beer O'Clock with Slosh and Buzz and Space Peanut. <laughs> we have the second one of our fourth run, which is Singer. Would we, would we pronounce that Singer? Um, Singer, which is premium imports good. Marga beer, the original Thai beer since 1933. Does that mean that was the first beer ever made in Thailand? They didn't have a beer till 1933. I don't believe because it says that. it's the original one. I don't believe that. I'd be able to tell you if I can navigate this stupid website. Yeah. I can. Due to technical difficulties, we aren't able. Our to Google man couldn't work it out. Provide you with the answers <laughs> to the mystery of the origins of Singer. <laughs> today. <laughs> this is going to be an interesting run. Okay, this is a uh, 5% alcohol. It's imported by combined wines and foods. Mm. Um, ingredients, water, malt and hops. Let's, let's give Singer Keeping a red hot Keeping it simple crowd. there in Thailand. No hepatitis? Uh, no hepatitis, that's in berries. That's for healthy people. Cool. Mm. Just try it safe. Hey, hepat look, look, hepatitis there's not as many is. bubbles as the last one. There's still it a lot looks, of bubbles. It almost <laughs> looks exactly like no, the other one. No, no, no. It has a head. Actually, no, I turned it very around. Very pale. Like, and it's crystal clear. It looks like champagne, then. By royal permission. May I have some of your beer? No, you fuck royal off. Thai Queen. It's the original beer. Oh, I put it in number one. <laughs> <laughs> this has got the other beer's flavour in it. <laughs> Alright, folks. We're attempting something. <laughs> Let's just sit back. Yeah. That was a good one. It's still going to have the taste of the other one in it anyway. Decanted like a pro. That's what I make out of decant. Okay, that's very... <laughs> uh, Alright. Cheers. 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 I missed. Sing it. Sing it. Do people actually watch this on the yeah, they do. They do. Um, yeah. Normally this hasn't happened to week four, but it's fine. <laughs> It actually tastes quite similar to the last one. It does. Almost the same. Very similar. I, it almost, it I doesn't, it doesn't, there's no... Flavor, I like it. What? Way more flavour. That was I just... I like it better. Slightly that was better. some form of discharge. That is... better. <laughs> so this is like the waste product of this? Of, of brewing Could this? be. Well, See, this is a problem. I let them just keep going. Thing. Did you give away the thing? Oh. Uh, waste Hold products. on. Maybe. I love to see you. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I am going to give an overall presentation. I'm going to give this, I'm going to give it five, but given the fact it's actually claiming to be the first beer ever made in Thailand, I'm going to give it seven for pure balls. And on taste, I'm going to give it four because it actually has a nicer aftertaste than the last one, which was kind of just awful. Discharging. Yeah, I know you said that before. I'm just yeah. moving on with my, my life. Um, yes. So I'm going to four on flavour and yeah, seven because it's got the balls to say it's the first beer ever made in Thailand. It's got an imported stamp. Don't see how that makes it the first beer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to leave it up to you guys now. Um, yeah. I'm going to give it a five on flavour because we drank a lot of it in Thailand and we built Singer Tower out of Singer beer cans. Where the pool staff couldn't get them. Ah, these pile of cans. Um, presentation, it just looks like a beer. Two. Uh, <laughs> five on flavour, so seven all up. It's, yeah, definitely better than that, but so is most things. <laughs> <laughs> so is things I don't like are better than that one. I'm gonna give it a, <laughs> a six on presentation. Looks like champagne in the glass. It does. Like if we poured that into a champagne glass, we could trick yeah. people at parties and make them drink <laughs> something that's not champagne. Directly <laughs> through it. It's just disturbing. Um, and I'll give well, it a three on flavour. It's slightly it's better than the other one. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give it a three on flavour because it's, def it's definitely better than the other one. But it's not saying. Should much. we use this that's as our like worst beer we ever tried? Like mm. all of the scales. I mean. We could go back and put that one, and that's like the worst beer we've had. On yeah, a rating from Lucky Buddha to. We haven't found it yet. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah. You got nothing else to add? No, that's all. Two kind of average beers in a row. That's right. Let's hope it gets better, folks. We've had, in, in the past, we've tried really nice beers. Mm. Did we punish ourselves? I thought it was when we were going to do the EB, the MB, the VB, like <laughs> the Australian B Week. Oof. 
Like I thought, like the B movie week was going to be Future the bad Future themes, week. spoilers. Yeah, there's there's no prize for the B week. No, well, it's just a for us. Happy Tigers B, maybe. Anyway, we're going to finish this one. As always, guys, yeah. thanks for watching. There's a theme. Guess it. Bottle of hot sauce and. <laughs> you bastard. We literally <laughs> have had two really really average beers in a row. Really hoping the next one we picked is actually pretty good. Yeah. Are you hesitantly optimistic? No. <laughs> Next week's going to be better or worse? Better. You reckon it's going to be better? It's got to be. What about you? Better or worse? Can't get worse. Find out next week. <laughs> See you later, folks. See ya.